So guys, I got a confession to make, you know, a few weeks ago, I discovered a magic white new thing that really blew me away. It, uh, it promised to do so many things for me that I almost couldn't believe it came through on those promises. As soon as I discovered this magic white object, I immediately purchased all different kinds that I could. I purchased lots of them. I bought my friends a lot of magic white stuff. I raved about the magic white stuff. They were all blown away about the magic white stuff. And I'm setting this up to sound like something else, but I'm actually talking about the Mr. Clean's magic eraser now. I never thought in a million years that I would be, I don't know, impressed or just kind of blown away by a cheap household sponge. I heard about it on a glass cleaning site. Like apparently if your glass is extremely dirty or you just can't clean it, um, people were talking about using the magic eraser, but obviously I don't have too many um, like dirty pipes. And like, I don't even remember like if it worked too well or if it didn't, I could, to be honest, I couldn't remember. So I had it sitting around and um, I think I was like wiping down my car or something. And I just saw it and I'm like, yeah, let me go try it. And I, I'm just absolutely blown away that I got to this age right here and I never knew that this magic eraser existed. I, I just, I cannot, I just literally cannot believe it because I've used almost every kind of cleaning utensil. I've used all kinds of mops. I've used all kinds of brooms. I've used all forms of cleaners and usually cleaners actually help quite a bit. Um, I use like vinegar or hydrogen peroxide, sometimes rubbing alcohol, but rubbing alcohol can like stain certain things at certain times. So you kind of have to be careful. I, you know, obviously because I'm a human, I have to clean all the time. So, you know, I've cleaned tons of stuff. I've used tons of cleaners and I'm just absolutely blown away by this product. If you are somebody who has never tried the Mr. Clean's Magic Eraser, what I suggest for you to do is to just go and get any sort of like washcloth or cleaning utensil and just go ahead and start cleaning your house until you come across something that you just can't wipe off, right? Get your normal stuff to go clean things. Eventually you're going to come across something that you can't get off or, you know, it's gonna take lots and lots and lots of tries or it's not even budging. Like you're just scraping, scraping and it's like, hey, maybe it's like a full on scratch or it's some sort of like crazy deep stain or something. So I'm serious, like literally water and the magic eraser will, I would say, 90 to 95% chance of getting that off. Unless it's a scratch, unless like maybe it's some rare material or, you know, stain maybe, but but this stuff is absolutely a magic. It is absolutely magic. I have no other words for it. Like there's so many times where I will come across like such a big dirty area that I'll just like put tons of cleaner on and I'll just scrape and scrape and scrape and I'll just get a barely a little nick off of it. And it's like, man, this is like, that's going to literally take me like maybe a couple bottles to get this off. Like the magic eraser, like for that situation, probably, probably would get everything off. You know, if it was like, like maybe like a foot by a foot dirty area and like, I don't know, maybe like a minute or two, like you would immediately see it starting to come off. And I am just absolutely, I, I just, I feel so dumb that people aren't telling everybody about this. Like everybody goes and cleans things and comes across stuff that just doesn't come off or it takes forever and you're telling me this little white cheap sponge all i gotta get get that in some water and i could get off like pretty much absolutely anything like anything that you can't get off with your best cleaner in the world and a washcloth i could get off with this little magic eraser so um does it have downsides the only downside i would say is that if you're not careful with it um you can go across a rough surface and you could eat it up really really quick if you're not careful but having used a lot of them and trying to kind of preserve them now um, if you're careful about how aggressively you push against extremely rough surfaces that will make it last longer you can kind of tell when it's starting to get ripped on a surface and try to stop at that point um, also it, it's more of a sponge than I remember or than I thought so um, you do need to wring it out every now and again. And sometimes they're obviously it'll soak up a lot of um, dirt and things. And so if you're not soaking it out, you'll eventually wipe against the wall and the dirt will just come out and bleed, you know, back on the wall, whatever you're wiping off. But I mean, it's going to be amazing for sneakers. It's going to be amazing for your car. It's just, I'm, I'm just absolutely blown away. And I'm mad that this isn't like common knowledge. Like I probably spent like 120, maybe $140 at least on magic erasers 
as soon as I found out how good they are. Like I bought my friends one, I gave one of my coworkers one. And apparently both my coworkers were uh, with one magic eraser, were able to get off stains that they could not get off before. Like they were just in their mind, they both cleaned their cars, they both handled their stuff. But in their mind, they couldn't get off these stains and one magic eraser is all it took. And I actually gave them the thin one. So they have like multiple different kinds, ones for the bathroom, um, thicker ones, uh, multi-packs, sometimes it has like a, a variety, things like that. So I just tried the thin ones out, had the thin ones on me, gave one to my coworker, and then he gave the other one to my other coworker, and that's how they both tried it. And it's a great story is my coworker is a vegan. So he got egged coincidentally. It had nothing to do with him being a vegan, but as you can imagine, um, that would piss you off quite a bit as a vegan. And apparently I don't really understand this, but apparently the eggs like just stain. So, I mean, his car had been rained on. He has just went and just tried to scrub it off as much as he could. I had tried it so much. So I knew that the it's legit magic eraser i kept being like it can't be this good but it is that good you know and it's like i'm not into cleaning i'm not into cheap little tools i would never think that i'd ever make a video about this and if i did i would think the sponge is going to be like 20 dollars. it's not going to be super cheap but um anyways back to the story he's a vegan he gets eggs he can't get it off he's you know went through car washes he scrubbed it off we had crazy rain this year rain didn't do anything to it I give him one magic eraser. He's very practical. He's very no nonsense. So I'm telling him what it's gonna do. And he's very like, you know, bro, like I respect you. Like I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it, but like this just seems like the dumbest thing. Like that was his reaction. Like just because it's you, I, I'm not gonna say this is the dumbest thing ever, but this is pretty dumb. So as soon as he says that, I, I look for one, I find one, I give it to him. And I asked him, do you have anything here that you can't get off? He says the egg, we go right to the egg, the egg starts coming off. He gets probably the entire egg off in like maybe two minutes, three minutes tops. And it was like maybe like a foot and a half by a foot and a half spread out egg. So, I mean, just, just imagine that. You got, you know, you can kind of, kind of, you hate dead animals and all that stuff and people eating them. Someone takes a dead animal, wastes it, on your car and you know what i mean you go and you try to get it off you can't get it off your, your random co-worker shows up he says hey there's this thing that's in every store it's a cheap little sponge like less than five bucks and you don't need any special cleaner and it just works and it doesn't scratch your car and he's like okay like i just it's amazing it's just amazing that it's not more common knowledge so anyways guys this video is super long longer than i expected mr clean magic eraser it's that good it's the truth um if you have not used it go use it now like it is so fun because it gets every, like it's just unlike anything else it gets everything off it's amazing so if have you tried the magic eraser what are your thoughts on the magic eraser do you think it's that good do you have something that's better because i almost wonder if there is a better product out there because things always get better so if you know of anything that's better than the magic eraser let me know anyways guys thank you guys so much for watching the video it means so so much to me i'm having a great day out here hopefully having a great day at home see you all in the next video